Tonight, cameras may have met their match. The 11 News Eye team has discovered a controversial product that's supposed to shield your license plate from the camera's eye. Certainly, it's got a lot of attention. People are buying it. Tonight, Eye Team reporter David Collins asks, does it work? Is it legal? And will it put your safety at risk? They loom over busy intersections. Boys like ray guns to zap the tags of drivers who run red lights. Taking cash in a flash and screaming, gotcha. Baltimore City has 47 red light cameras, more than any other city in the entire country. Taking in more than $23.3 million since 1999. And forcing some people to find inventive ways to beat the system. This is one of them. A clear spray designed to blind the cameras. Photo blocker is supposed to make license plates so reflective, the tag becomes unreadable. Going through these intersections. The man behind this red light camera sign doesn't want police to know who he is. But he says he's one satisfied customer. How do you know it works? I've seen the cameras go off right behind me. And uh, from that, I've never received anything. So I guess no news is good news. The I-Team contacted many jurisdictions in the state which use red light cameras, hoping one would put photo blocker to the test but all declined. The Denver, Colorado Police Department wasn't afraid to test photo blocker. They used it against one of their speed cameras. Based on the photo finish, the product works. TV Channel 10 in Australia also tested photo blocker. This is a number plate photograph before photo blocker. This is it after being sprayed. State lawmakers outlaw plate covers, but the statute doesn't specifically address sprays. Is it legal or illegal? Uh, we are not sure. We have not had an interpretation of the statute as of yet from the courts. The company that makes and markets photoblocker says it doesn't encourage anyone to run red lights. It's for the people that accidentally get caught or are accidentally speeding. They don't necessarily do it. But even if it is outlawed here in Maryland, it would be nearly impossible to detect. At $30 a can, the makers of photoblocker are cashing in. Since red light cameras have become a traffic control fixture, the business of battling Big Brother has grown. For the 11 News IT, I'm David Collins.